The coronavirus is hitting close to home for the president. One of Trump's personal valets has tested positive. A valet is like um, someone that serves him or works with him and his assistant. Uh, a member of the U.S. Navy who personally drives the president and his family exhibited symptoms yesterday morning and is now confirmed to have COVID-19. The president reportedly remains in good health. Meantime, you're never going to believe what officials in Washington state are warning people not to do after they saw a rise in cases. They say people have been holding COVID-19 parties where unaffected people mingle with someone who has the virus in an attempt to catch it. Okay, you might have heard this with the chicken, chicken pox, pox, right? Yeah. We all got the chicken pox and you get together. It's a play date because that's not fatal. Uh, this is a horrendous idea. Al, as a biology grad, how would you descri describe this? Well, this is what I call chickens coming home to roost, Tori. And what I mean by that is science is the only thing that's questioned by people. You go on a message board yeah. and people that are not qualified are questioning climate scientists. They don't, I wouldn't go on a message board from Midas and talk to them about how they should rebuild an engine or redo somebody's brakes. That's not my area of expertise but everybody thinks that they do research by clicking on internet articles not knowing where they're coming from or the validity of them and now you have people that don't know what they're talking about talking to other people that don't know what they're talking about and you come up with COVID parties not knowing how you're going to react so this is what's going to happen and what's going to happen is what's going to happen that's true every disaster movie starts with someone in the government ignoring a scientist